Praise the Lord. Praise our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. May the peace of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, that surpasses our understanding, always be with you. In Jesus' name. You are most welcome to this teaching. We are going to examine the truth that there are blessings in fearing the Lord. In other words, the blessings of fearing the Lord. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, let us understand, Lord, that when we fear you, Lord, we are blessed. And let us fear you, Lord Jesus, because, O oh Lord, of who you are, you are almighty, you are all-powerful, you are omnipotent, you are omniscient, you are omnipresent, you are the potter, and we are the clay. Lord Jesus, help us to understand that you are the potter, and we are the clay. We give you all the praise. We give you all the honor. In the mighty name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Amen. Let's read Psalm 112, verse 1a, part a of verse 1 of Psalm 112. In other words, Psalm 112, verse 1, part a. I read. Praise in the Lord. Blessed is the man that feareth the Lord. Hallelujah. Blessed is the man that feareth the Lord. Blessed is the woman that feareth the Lord. Blessed is the believer that feareth the Lord. Blessed is the Christian that feareth the Lord. Blessed is that woman, is that man that feareth the Lord. May you be that woman. May you be that man. May you be that believer. May you be that Christian that fear the Lord in Jesus' name. May you fear the Lord all the days of your life in Jesus' name. May you fear the Lord daily all the days of your life in Jesus' name. Many Christians are rebels. The church is full of rebels today. Many believers in the Lord Jesus Christ are rebels. The church is full of rebels. People go to church but they do not obey the word of God. People go to church and they rebel against the word of God. People go to church and they are indifferent vis-a-vis -vis the word of God. People go to church and they are lukewarm vis-a-vis -vis the word of God. If you are one of them, repent now in Jesus' name. Fear the Lord all the days of your life and obey his word in Jesus' name. Understand that the Lord is the potter and you are the clay. Fear him and be richly blessed. Fear him and he will bless you abundantly. Fear him and he will bless you in Jesus' name. Brethren, the fear of the Lord is very, very important. You cannot call yourself a Christian and you do not fear the Lord. You cannot call yourself a believer and you do not fear the Lord. It is of power importance for you to understand that the Lord is the potter and you are the clay. Who is the clay to question the potter? 
the potter has the right to do whatever thing he wishes to declare. All the clerk can do is to fear the porter, is to obey the porter, is not to question the porter arrogantly, as many Christians do today. The Lord God Almighty is almighty, is all powerful, is omnipotent, is omnipresent, is omniscient. He knows everything about everything. He is the creator of the universe and everything in it. He rests and rolls forever and ever. He is from the everlasting to everlasting. He is from eternity to eternity. He is the first and the last. He is Alpha and Omega. He is the beginning and the end. We are just the clay and he is the potter. Therefore, it is our duty to fear him. It is our responsibility to fear him daily, all the days of our life. It is our duty to fear him all the days of our life. It is our duty to fear him to fear him daily in these last days. May you fear the Lord God Almighty daily all the days of our life. In these last days, in Jesus' name. It is time for us to pray. Pray that you will fear the Lord daily in these last days. Pray that you will fear the Lord in these end times. Pray that you will fear the Lord always. And His blessings will come upon you in Jesus' name. Heavenly Father, we thank you for your word. Your word is crystal clear that we fear you. Lord, we are blessed. Help us to fear you in every respect. Help us to fear you in every area of our life so that we bless in Jesus' name. We give you all the praise. We give you all the honor. May, they, may you be exalted, worshipped, adored, and praise forever and ever in the mighty name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Amen. Remain blessed until we see again and share the video on all your various social media platforms and subscribe to the channel if you have not yet done so so that together we shall prepare ourselves for heaven in Jesus' name. Remember, bless until we see you again. Bye bye. In Jesus' name. Amen.